good morning to you. It's the St. Patrick's Day. Irish accent sucks. Then you do it. Oh, top of the morning to you. Oh, top of the morning to you. Okay. It's St. Patrick's Day. We're going to the store to pick up some Irish food. Some food. Some food. Food. As expected, March Madness is pretty mad right now. Uh, everybody's bracket is pretty much busted. Except for ours. Oh. Um, I, I mean, mean Virginia. We've definitely had some, some big toll hits, but I didn't have Virginia winning, so. <laughs> and the rest of the teams, I pretty much figure we're going to win and win it. Virginia losing by 20 points to UMBC. Uh, congratulations to those those guys. They really pulled off a big bracket buster and probably pissed off a lot of bookies. Bookies? Um, yeah, bookies. I wonder if anyone actually had that money. You know, um... That'd be crazy if they If did. they did and they bet on it, they just made a lot. And they have the matzo ball mix right here and squares, matzo meal. Oh my god. It reminds me of my childhood. I kind of want to make one. wonder if Brandon would like it. Garlic tahini dressing. That sounds fantastic. Toasted corn. That looks really good. Our favorite. There. Oh, there's a sample. Cheddar with Guinness. 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 What do you think of it? Yeah. Does it taste like Guinness? I don't. I don't like Guinness. I don't want one. It does. It like has like a little. Just try it. I don't like black. Just try it. Use the tongs. That's what they do. Yeah, you really can't taste the Guinness. Oh, it tastes really good. After. It's got like a little after taste. Yep. Yeah. Well, do you want a sample? No. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> 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 It's got a sword behind us. Oh, wow. wow. You got the receipt for a spun? What? So you want to have Starbucks or have a different coffee place? What? That's weird. Why wouldn't we get coffee? It's three in the afternoon. I get decaf. This guy has coffee. We need coffee too. <laughs> Thank you. So Brandon was just like, he was like, asked for another straw for Wells, and he was like, aren't we not like doing the whole straw thing anymore? And I totally forgot, and it's just such a habit. So I read an article recently, and it was saying how, how much plastic waste is in the oceans and how much we use um, straws and how they're not 
recyclable. And I had no idea that they weren't recyclable. I just figured it was plastic and it would be like recycled with the rest of this. And I know Starbucks sells their green straws. Um, I think it's like four for five bucks. Straws. Brandon! And the article even said, it was like, we just go about, we use straws like this all day, every day, and not, <coughs> stop, not thinking about it. It's four o'clock. Just got home, putting away the groceries. So we want to show you guys the one thing that I got at Ulta today. It is a new face wash from Mario Badescu, the seaweed cleansing soap. It smells so good. It's hard to describe exactly what what it smells like. Brandon smelled it and he wasn't fond of it, but I'm fond of the scent. Also stopped at the post office and got 60 stamps to put on our save the dates, which are right here. So hopefully we will get those out by Monday. So for dinner tonight, I'm going to be making Irish soda bread. So traditional Irish soda bread and Cole Cannon. So I've never made either one of these before, but I'll figure out if it turns out good, I guess, right? They don't really seem that hard to make. They don't really seem that complicated. What are you up to, Mr. Wells? What are you doing? Hanging out? I oh, handsome. Oh, you're gonna crawl to me? Okay. Hi. I'm trying my dear sassy. So here is my first attempt at traditional Irish soda bread. So while the soda bread is baking, I'm gonna start the coal cannon.
eat. You ready for your Irish meal? Are you ready? Yeah. So our Coke cannon looks like this. How, what do you think of it? The Coke cannon. DD. Throw some butter on there. Throw some butter on that too. And I have my vegetarian sausages and Brandon has his bangers. Yeah. That's a crazy story. That's crazy. It is the end of the night. We just put Wells to bed. We gave him a bath, as you saw, put, put him to bed. Now I'm just making tea and my favorite Elodos Real Greek yogurt lemon curd. They make a few different ones. They make a mango one, they make this one, a passion fruit. They make a few different ones. Marionberry. The Marionberry and the lemon curd are my favorite. And let me show you guys this tea really quick. This is my new favorite tea. It's from Celestial. Seasonings, mint magic. Yeah, it'd be helpful if I actually got that in frame. I love Hana. It's a wizard with a unicorn, so you know. That's how you know it's gonna be good. But that is gonna end it for us here tonight, you guys. We will see you all tomorrow. Good night.